Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 2 The 7 Day Round Robin. Last time we were playing as Anthrax and we were just, you know, messing around with the house, just taking care of Steven over here. And we were also doing a very last minute kind of just getting the three loves kind of wish that just out of the way and all that. Now that Friday is done and over and out with, today is Saturday. About fucking time. Uh, who can ever go wrong with Saturday? And what better way of celebrating Saturday than to play as Nutcase Food Bar? About fucking time we play as Nutcase. Because he indeed is quite the Nutcase, alright. Ugh. Those don't look good. I'll let the main do it. No, Nutcase. You just have some fun, alright? That's all you just gotta do. I don't know what Bobby's doing. I think, yeah, I fucked him up with the, with that deal. Let's just go and join on the, 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 uh, the hot tub. Just so we can get soak off in there. Nothing, nothing special. Just soaking. The nutcase probably needs to, like, burn off that belly fat. All just, all because he gorged on some soup. Because everyone was just getting sick to their stomach. Nope. <laughs> he just fucking splashed him. Luckily, it's just a funny interaction, not really like a, you know, like cuddling. But they're just here just to be friends and hang them. Never mind. They're already friends for one, but, uh, well, pumped up pumpkin's done, so. And he's hungry. How about we just serve some food up, you know? I don't care if we burn some of this money away, but... It's all good, just just a little bit of it. We have some breadwinners here. That can help with that deal, right? Yeah. Don't eat that. No! Pumped up pumpkin, you... You know what? That's on you if you want to eat it. That's, that's entirely on you. I'm not going to say otherwise. Fuck it. And there goes my cat trying to, like, get inside. Not Timothy, but Toby this time. Ah, uh, he just likes to... Every time I have my door closed for some reason, like, just, you know, trying to get stuff done, all that stuff. Any door, really. Bathroom, the, the middle room, 3D printing room, bedroom. <laughs> Fucking parents' room, fucking any room, really. Toby just wants to come on inside. So does Misty. All the animals, really, but mostly the cats. I haven't really had the dogs, like, just... Well, bathroom-wise, especially. Cats just trying to do your business, but these like to fuck around stuff, trying to, like, climb up everywhere. It's like, fuck off. Maybe one big old fart can probably scare him away. <laughs> Out of the bathroom. <laughs> Sadly, it doesn't work for all animals, though. Only certain ones. What the fuck is just... They're still going at it. It's been seven days and they're still fucking fighting. Oh my god. And Bobby is just... He's down. He's down for the count. Let's just... Let's just speed up on by all that stuff. Because we need to get our energy up. Get some turkey. Just before... Oh, come on, really? Where even the hell is Steven? Oh, where? Yeah, there he is. God damn it, Steven. How would you get some food for goddamn once? Otherwise, you might have to go to school and then do that. Let's see what's, uh, let's see what's good. Will he go to school and eat? Or will he just say fuck off to school? 
and they just get taken away by that stupid bitch, the social worker. So are you gonna get some food, or are you just gonna, come on. Where even the hell is Steven? Oh, don't be such a crybaby with your fucking aspiration. Oh, wow. If you want to flirt. Hmm. Ooh, yeah, in that case, we could probably do so. We have to be very subtle with anthrax. Flirt. Be flirted with. Now he's getting recharged. Now you're getting fulfilled and you're hungry, you little shithead. Now we just gotta wait. Could read a novel, but we don't even have a novel. We have to write one up. In a nutcase, gonna get a job? Probably not. We already have plenty of breadwinners. Can we go upstairs? Hang out with, uh, with Anthrax? Nah, she's gonna go to bed. Can we serenade with her? No. Not unless I pull off that one trick where I wake her ass up and then do a quick little flirt. Be flirted with. Flirt. Well, I guess I'm gonna have to. And you know what? This ain't gonna wake Sims up, so as much as I'd like to wake him up with the snowman, cannot. We're gonna have to blast some salsa. There you go. Pardon me for that as well. I just can a bid. It ain't the flu from the roaches. It ain't the flu from these pricks. So yeah. Oh. What the fuck happened? It was one of them was fulfilled, but one of them was not. One of them was a fear that got fulfilled. What the fuck happened? That actually spooked me. Oh no, maybe someone like is the social bunny and all that stuff, or a therapist, and I confused it for the uh, for the fear sound. I don't remember. I don't know. Oh shit! Um, that machine is done fucked. Jeez, what the fuck was... Alright, well, whatever. We're gonna examine the Sherpa or the Llama? Llama! Yeah, let's go! Llama to boot to boot! Nicely done. Oh, you're getting cheered up. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, y'all fuckers need to move out of the way because I want to practice my charisma. Why is everyone crowding in the bathroom? Is this a fucking bathroom party now? You, know, you want to buy a bubble blower? Are you a bubble blowing baby? Well, to be fair, nutcase, well, yeah, nut fuda. Well, I will say, pretty much is technically. According to the game files, a baby. I mean, he's literally a fucking. Well, while he has the appearance of an adult male, I'm pretty sure all of Spectre may have hit him on the fucking head, which rendered him pretty much like a baby. A baby state kind of deal. I mean, you get fucking bonked in the head, it ain't gonna end pretty for you. I mean, if you don't die, yeah, that is. Then yeah, you'll you'll then have some pretty bad head injuries. But hey, you'll be lucky to survive those head injuries if yeah, if you know you do come up with such come out of that kind of deal. Make it blue. Yeah, actually no, we're gonna. I'm a little cheap over here, so I'm just gonna. Oh well, it doesn't make much of a difference. 
just fucking pay up the balls bullshit. And funny enough that, yes, you can color these separately. Alright, so... Hang on, let's follow this in a particular order. We have player one, two, three, and four. So who's player one gonna be? Are we gonna do smash layout? Are we gonna do weave color layout? Or are we gonna do like Lego Star Wars or Pokemon Stadium layout? We, baby. We would like to play. Ha 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 ha. Yeah. We would definitely love to play this. Yes, you're gonna be a bubble blowing baby, all you fucking one nut. But first off, you gotta be one charismatic bubble blowing baby. Oops. So Steven's at school, and Bobby's playing in the puddle, which you shouldn't really be doing there, buddy. Come on, Bobby Bot. Get the fuck off the puddle. Bobby the Bot. Bobby Boogie Bot. And he's just dancing. He's dancing in the rain. Singing in the rain. Uh, it's not even raining there, first off. And second off, I guess play it all you want because there's no puddles. So finish this off, use the bathroom. And after we do that, we're just going to go work out a bit because... Nut needs to... Oh, we need to close off all this shit. And Steven brought a friend from school. Greensburg Pencil Neck. Hey, Pencil Neck! Slither over here! You give me that ice cream back right now, or I'll make short work of you. Okay, obviously that wasn't the actual quote. Well, I don't to the free site the full long quote, but I know that first half. <laughs> Let him have it. Oh, you can have it. Uh, really? That's not what he meant by you can have it, SpongeBob. Well, the guy's literal minded, first off. And second off, the guy's, well. An extreme doormat. He's a sponge. He's soft. Plankton said not to say it, but I have to say it. He's a sponge. He's supposed to be soft and porous. Absorbent and yellow and porous is he. SpongeBob SquarePants. And you know what? If nautical nonsense is something you wish, then drop on the deck and flop like a fish. Yeah, that's right. Now chant for SpongeBob for me. But not for modern Spongebob. Fuck that modern age fucking shit. Steven Hillenberg would be rolling in his grave. As if he isn't right now. If he saw modern age Spongebob. Like, I'm just gonna say this now. I'm pretty sure everyone knows this now. That, yeah, modern age Spongebob is just... You know, I don't mind shock value here and there. But they implement it too much. They get creepy here and there, and it's just... May as well be fetish fuel the episode. Or the show. I thought Adventures of Sonic the Hedgehog was fetish fuel for some. <clears throat> Spongebob is ten times that. It's like... It's if Meat Canyon fucking took over. Even Meat Canyon has standards, because he wouldn't fucking sell out to fucking... Working with Nickelodeon. I'm sure he's got fucking standards, but enough of that shit. Enough of that minor, moderate, major-ish rant about Spongebob. New, new age Spongebob, I'll say. Classic is where it's at. The older episodes. Yeah, there were some bad older episodes here and there, sure. I mean, every show had its 
had shit episodes, even in the good old days. But I'd rather watch even the bad episodes from back then than any modern age episode of SpongeBob. Fuck no. Really, any show. I'm, there's a reason why I'm more of a classics kind of guy, playing classic games pretty much 9 out of 10 times. 8 out of 10, I don't know, I can't really do fractions or math. Fuck math. I'm not gonna do it at the moment. They're basic here and there, but I'm just... I just thought I was doing business. You know, like that one kid on Hey Arnold. Who thought he was just doing business, but turns out he was doing math. You see, if you can incorporate, you know, learning with something fun, I guess... You can make math fun in a way, or something interesting or cool. Gotta do quite a bit of number stuff here and there, everywhere. Where the hell is Steven's homework, speaking of which? Alright, well, we gotta help Steven with his homework. And we'll do it outside, because, you know what, fuck him. We'll let him have his fun, though, you know. Let the child have his innocence for a while. Play some Pimp Viking 3D, which I don't think, you know. Judging by the name of shit, I'm pretty sure that'd be more tier M rated. But who gives a shit? Kids played Mortal Kombat back in the day. They played Grand Theft Auto often. So, not that, you know, normally kids should be doing it, but... But hey, didn't, doesn't stop them. I, I can't really stop him either, so... And I'm not trying to stop him. You know, that's just a, you know, what normally would be the thing, but, you know, now the new norm is this and shit like that. Wow, what in the... F there is some beef going on here with fucking Rosarita. I thought Anthrax was gonna be one starting shit. Wow, okay. Never mind, I can't help us, Steven. I could buy a stereo, sell it, and then do that fucking that deal right there. It just says a stereo. It doesn't have to be the most expensive one. And you know, because of all that deal, there you go, you just fucking implement that. And now we can just Oh, come on, all that work for that? We're still... Alright, well, we'll worry about it later. We gotta get his homework done. <coughs> Excuse me. Ah, damn it. Damn it, Steven. Little shithead. Fine. You wanna do your homework or not? I mean, I know it's Friday, but I'd rather get that shit done. Over and out with. Can nutcase repair? No. He can call someone up to repair. And you know what? Fuck it. We're gonna do so. Nah. We'll influence someone to repair. If we can get you to repair. Alright, get your workout done. And now you can repair. Can you repair? Alright, who's on the phone? Who's at the phone? Answer the phone. There you go. Oh, hey. My delivery buddy, how you doing, Jaden? What's up? How How is the deliveries going? Yeah, I bet they're going real damn well, aren't they? Of course. Look at all these fucking magazines. Someone's gonna have to clean them up. And the Suro ain't gonna do shit. Can we just delete them like such? Wow, ten bucks. Don't get rid of them. Just eBay that shit. <laughs> there we go. Free repair work. Oh, yeah, Pumped Up Pumpkin and 
Yeah, you are gonna have to be. Oh crap! Now, once we're Rita's done, I guess we'll just say fuck it and repair. Call the repair lady then. If she comes over, whatever, it's fine. I'll pay it up. We have all the money in the world, so fuck it. I have a little something special to do soon. But just you wait. Just you wait on that. I can't really explain this special. But I'm going to be refining the common mistake I've been making with this sort of method, I will say. And a method we don't have to do as much anymore. And it's all thanks to having the Night Length expansion pack. But I will get into what I'm trying to say momentarily. Very momentarily. We're only 20 minutes in or so. So, let's not get ahead of ourselves. We're gonna do some, but we juggle. Nope, juggle. Juggle bottles. We'll see a proper juggle soon, but for now, I just want to get that one out of the way. And get his body out. Oh, nice. Got his body all good and square. Let's just go and go do another juggle. The proper time to do some juggling then. Alright. Come on. Come on, nutcase. Nice. That case doing pretty well here. Oh, you want to throw a sports party? Well, I was going to plan on throwing a party very soon, so... Hey, why the hell not? Why in the hell not? If I had another mirror. Oh, this mirror would be fa- oh, fancy. Really fancy, holy shit. This one. Gold. Silver. I like the gold because Anthrax got the gold, bitches! Anyway, let's practice your speech. Because I need to attract all these fuckers to just fight in the goddamn bedroom. Oh yeah, of course I forgot that Rosarita and Anthrax got some beef. But we're gonna show who the boss. Anthrax definitely will. I mean, they both got max body skill, I'm pretty sure. So... Yeah, no, that'll be perfectly fine. It's a, it's a pretty even battle. Oh, come on! All because someone had a fight. Get out of the room. Get out of the room. Just go in the other one. Do your deal. Mm, body. Or charisma. Using this one will be a good deal, however. Everything seems to be A-OK -okay here. Well, thank you. You know it's very soon though? I might consider the, yeah, the sports party. But, uh... Not gonna be much of a sports party, is it? Like that one episode. Or like that one special kind of playthrough I did. Misc playthrough. Where's the sports bar? There's the sports bar. Oh, yeah. Places are right around here. Public access. Nah. Around probably here, perhaps. Get the shit out of here. 
Actually, no, I want to keep it. Place it somewhere else. Like, uh... Around here would be fine. There we go. Perfection. It's some party stuff here, lady. Oh, now you want to get the drink. As soon as I place it down, she wants a drink. Nicely done, Viola. Now. Take out the trash. Yeah, you take out that trash. Actually, no, wait. Nah. That'll be fine. Just save the fucking maid some trouble. Oh, fucking hell, Bobby. Get out of the way. I'm just trying to take out the fucking trash here, you goddamn dumbass. Or if we can, like, you know, get her on board. Just, like, make her stay after work. You know, party. Join on in in the party. Gotta wait till Satch Boogie is back at work. Don't want to miss him out on the, uh, the little party over here. I don't care if Steven fears the party. But speaking of which, can we help Steven with his homework? <laughs> oh, come on. No, we cannot because he's asleep. Not unless I can fix that. Rise and shine, you little shithead. It's time to get your homework done. I don't care if you don't like it, don't like the music or some shit, but you gotta fucking... Nope. Help with homework. Help with homework. Nope. You gotta help with homework. No! Fuck off! Oh my lord! Steven, you fucking dumb shit! There. You stopped him in time. Good. Now you can do your homework. Okay, good. Let's go and help with your homework now. Since you can't do it for jack shit. And can't even do it on your own. Get okay, done. Okay, good. Thank you. Now hug Uncle Nutcase. Yeah, everyone here is your metaphorical aunt and uncle because... Or your godmother and your godfather, all because your actual parents do not give a flying fuck about you and probably never will because they're that busy. But don't worry, Uncle Nutcase will help in, will help in, you know, just play catch with you. What better fucking wholesome deal than to just, uh, yeah. This is a very wholesome moment. <laughs> Who don't like Uncle Nutcase, huh? He may not be your actual uncle, but he's a everyone's uncle. The uncle that we that we need but probably don't deserve because everyone just If we deserve him, then everyone will take advantage of him. And that's why we don't deserve nice things. This is a nice thing that we do deserve. Ah, yes, Satch. Return from work. Yeah, hey, there you go. <laughs> Wrapping that up easily. Oh, shit. Letting the child go hungry. No, we're not. We are not doing that one bit. You fucking think so? I don't think so. Just like if I'm going back to Cali, 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 going back to Cali, I don't think so. I'm going back to Cali, 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 I'm going back to Cali, I don't think so. 
I go back to that shithole state. You're gonna invite the goddamn... Yeah, let's invite the wolves over for a party. Yeah, that's gonna go really swell. Alright, we'll go with the Cordial Twins, the Delivery Gal, Golden Child, and Jan. Yeah, get the maid on board. Not the wolves. Hmm. Whether they come to the party or not, that's no good. I don't really care. But we're just gonna serve up some food. Serve up some music. Oh shit, I need to get some music. Hey, I have that, that radio. Turn on the radio. And turn up the radio. Because I need the music. Give me some more. You know, how about we, uh, how about we go hang out with Jaden? I may not be in my proper attire, which I could probably change into, actually, quickly. Hey, you. Hey there. I'm in the right attire. Yeah, the two delivery folks just gonna be hanging about. And butterflies are present in the shop. And that stupid notification is also present in the shop. They're just talking about eggs. Talking about protein rocks over here getting cooked up in a pan. Sounds delicious, I'll add. Who don't like their protein rocks? You know, I come to just think about it. Like, of course, the egg is made of calcium carbonate, which is pretty much like a rock may, may as well be. It's fucking limestone. It's seashells, eggshells, limestone, chalk, uh, a few other things. Oh yeah, it's also your vitamin supplement at times, but anyway, set the point, fucking. Yeah, that's, that's basically how and why I call, sometimes call eggs protein rocks. Is because the shell itself is made of calcium carbonate, which indeed it is a rock. And I was like, how the fuck does a bird inside produce a rock? Like, a thin rocky layer inside of a, some protein kind of deal. And when you break it open, it's like... It's a very thin rock, but with, mm -hmm. yeah, like with that protein stuff. White and yellow. The yolk, that is. I wonder who the first person was to discover, like, the egg itself, like, the insides of the egg. Like, they probably confused it for a rock as well, like. Or fucking just like, mm. Thin rock. Nice, that one one. Rock oozing. Yeah, poor bastard also probably suffered from salmonella after tasting it without cooking it. We have to. We, we need to put fire on egg. On rock. On protein rock. <clears throat> well, whatever. I had a good scenario in my head there much earlier. I mean, I've been going to caveman before at times. I mean, while at work, I was trying to work on some Guitar Hero controllers on the side. And while there was a fly buzzing around, I got the, like, I got the, the, the wooden end of the hammer. There was no, like, hammer and, like, the metal bit where you just smash stuff on there. I grabbed the end part. And I just kill a fly with it. And I just... I just went all caveman after... We go back to caveman. We go back to monk. Not in this case. I'm pretty sophisticated, mind you. <laughs> yeah, as we all claim to be. Yet, we're more living in idiocracy than sophistication.
So how is Nutcase doing with her, with his new friend? Yeah, your friend indeed. <clears throat> so, yeah, we're just talking about some magic over here. Magic over there, yeah. Plenty of magic. Yeah, don't pop in there. Oops. Talk about ghosts. Oh shit, there's a connection with all the Spectre over here. Probably met some old woman and just got... Just killed. Trying to make one last delivery. Yeah, the one last delivery being literally his last delivery. Entirely. Mm, a good time. Hell yeah, it's a good time. So how's everyone else doing in this party? Oh yeah, one of the few times I'll have the radio up. How's Golden Child doing? He's not tearing up the yard. He's playing pool by the pool. So I'm gonna blow some bubbles. Oh yeah, let's go. So which one are we gonna be? Player three? We're gonna be green. Hey, not wrong being the the player three. The the green player. Do I shoot Pop Goes a Weasel faintly? <laughs> yeah, just very faintly. But he's getting drowned out by this fucking shit over here. Ain't hey, nothing wrong with the salsa music itself, it's pretty damn good. But the fucking music, it's just the stereo itself. Oh yeah, we had a pretty damn good party. It didn't display, but otherwise, we had a pretty good party. That's enough, that's enough. Let's just... Turn it off. That's probably a major earworm, because the fucking Family Guy deal. Let's... Yeah, we're gonna let's, uh... We're gonna let the goddamn game play by itself. While I go and play another game and just... Fuck around with other games. Alright, so Nutcase had a pretty damn good party. And there's still quite a bit of time to do. Obviously, because I'm speeding up through all this bullshit. <laughs> <clears throat> How is the... Oh, it's just... Ugh, flies. Get out of your stuff. Get out of the pajamas. Alright, get out of bed. Maybe get out of your pajamas sometime. Kiss. Wanna kiss. Hmm. Well, where the hell is Anthrax? Oh, right, in bed. Of course. Of... Of course. Just gotta finish up that uh, gelatin here while we have a proper kind of deal of omelets. Except that there's no more omelets on that deal, so let's get out some more leftovers. Another plate of omelets. Oh, come on! The same fucking case! Someone else can have it. Omelets, anyone? Here, have some pork ch chops. Have some pork chop, pork chop. I might as well just put it all away. And such boogies, time is about to, well, job about to come by. His time, huh, well. <laughs> What time? He's, he's still good to go. Well, 
Might as well hire some other service sims as well, just for the sake of it. How about a gardener? Yeah, just for the hell of it, you know, just because I say so. We have all this money in the world, we don't... We, it's okay, we can splurge some. Well, now. Such Boogie is ready to go to work in the fancy ride. And Bobby Boogie is powering down, recharging, and just blocking the, the dartboard. So, anyone who wants to play darts, you are shit out of luck because Bobby's in the way. Bobby Boogie Bot. Bobby the Boogie Bot. Always in the goddamn way of everything. Recycle. And recycle. Read the games magazine. Ooh, 12. Nice. Get that shit out of here. Man, they're all crying like shit. Stop being so, just so sissified and shit. Oh, wow, okay, never mind. They're just gonna watch a fight. Yeah, monkey go! Now let's go, who's gonna win this one? The mermaid or the military brat? The namesake, if you will. Why don't we just, uh, Comfort the child. Hang with him for a while, you know. Hang with Uncle Nutcase. He's not. He may be a nutcase, but he's more fucking sane than these fuckers. Yeah, now we finally got it done. How are we going? Kiss. Kiss anthrax. Did I gotta do this. Oh shit, what the fuck? Alright, oh, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot about that. And who else has to visit the social bunny? That poor child. Yeah, Nutcase forgot about that deal. Yeah, right in front of Pumped Up Pumpkin. So now we're gonna be dividing the family. Or household, rather. Yeah, let's take it out on the robot as well. What do you even ever do to you? Oh my lord. What the fuck just happened? What? What has happened with this household? Wow. That's just gonna be brawling the family once again. <laughs> can we ask, or can we read this kid to sleep? Yes. He's trying to go to bed, but he can't. Whoops. And there's Coral Reefer. I think that's one of the other daycare kids. Somewhere around the daycare again. I, I rebuilt the uh, Belladonna Cove kind of deal how it was before. Sort of. I'm just like, eh. I just did it anyway, because why not? So now, well, how about we, uh, yeah, wait for Satch Boogie to come on by. Can maybe do a little red kiss. Nah. You <laughs> flirt. Be flirted with. <laughs> be flirted with. 
Hey there. So you gonna be Flora back, or are you just gonna? <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, jeez. Try to serenade, but you ain't gonna do shit. Oh, what the fuck? Um. Oh. Social bunny. Right, I forgot. I was like, wait, what? Who's got the social bunny, though? That's the thing. Well, you know, in that case, uh, how about we just go and say fuck it to buy the family or something? I mean, not case, you know, reverted back to his baby state. He just, he forgot that leaping into arms was a romantic kind of thing, you know? Oh, <laughs> she's still in love. Wow. I have no clue what just happened there. It's almost like she got kind of back into him. It's like, what the fuck? It's like she forgot. Oh man. Never mind. Whatever. We tried. And he fucked up both relationships. <laughs> well, we might as well. Wait till Satch Boogie gets on board and. Wherever the hell he is, first off. I know he's at work, but I'm waiting for him to get back to from work. There he is. So how... Alright. Call over. Because why not? We'll call him over. And we'll just go... How about we just go and goose? Yeah, right in front of him. We're gonna have this whole whole household fall apart. Oh shit. Got betrayed. Oh <clears throat> it was him that did it though. <laughs> nutcase, you fucking nutcase. You absolute savage, I'll say. Yeah, keep at it. Oh, now you're just now you're witnessing a fight and stuff like that. You're just cheering on who's who. <laughs> well, got the hanger and you got the undine. Both just fighting it out. And you got Steven just witnessing all that shit. Excuse me as well, I had a bit of water. <clears throat> Throat was getting a little dry. Didn't help that I was smoking up some, so... That's good. And it's also a little reminder that you all should just stay the fuck hydrated. Do not hail to Hydra. Hail to Hydra. Alright, well, Anthrax, yeah, you're just cheering on by. Well, what, what would attract all these other folks into, like, you know, around this place? Oh, nice, you just littered the 
He's just fucking littered. Hmm. I could do a bit of reworking around. Wow, an actual gamer girl. Literally her name. It's supposed to be a play on like the gamer girl and the girl that plays games and stuff like that. The old meme from back in the day. The differences between such. She may claim to be one, but is she really one? Are you a real gamer? Can you do all these crazy challenges in The Sims 2 then? Are you a true gamer in that case? Hm? Are you ready to witness all this bullshit going on? Okay, yeah, I, I'm not really much. How am I to say that I'm like the truest gamer out there? I mean, of course, you can't always be a pure. But you always can't be a lying sack of shit. So, <clears throat> you gotta really balance it out, pretty much. I'm, I'm just gonna say, it, just to be honest here. Be flirted with. I'm just trying to get flirted with, goddammit. And then it's just. Whatever. Well, what I could do is just get everyone on board, rework this deal. Oh, wait. This probably wouldn't make too much of a difference, but. Yeah, I'm gonna reveal a bit of the plans here. So, to end off this whole, you know, episode, this recording session, this playthrough, all that shit. We're going to be trapping everyone else except maybe Nutcase. And we're going to be doing a crazy, much better method on how to like, oh, well, you know. Just burning all these other fuckers alive. Instead of using the stupid little oven method. So, we're just going to make some, uh, some clearance over here. And also, we're gonna move out to uh, the servo as well as Steven. I'm gonna be breaking those rules a little bit with when it comes to, well, selecting those two. But when it comes to the others, I'm gonna try and, you know, get them to all come over here. Somehow. I gotta find a way to do it. There's gotta be a way to attract everyone in the same room. I mean, this buffet table might come in handy. Good idea. A very good idea indeed. But I have to also make sure they stay in that room too. Yes. Please, fancy yourself at home now if you must. I do insist. So, now what? Get this chair out of here. And this lamp as well. And this fucking deal over here. Get this... Yeah, we can do this. We can just move some of these beds in here. That's a very good idea. Start relocating these beds, sell that bed. In case they all have to go to bed, then they can also just go to these beds. Easy enough. Get rid of that. Because we're going to need some room. We'll have to wait on all the others like come on by in case they have to go badly they can also just 
Uh, well. I don't know. We're gonna make like a false kind of room. There, one bathroom, one toilet. Soon enough. We're also gonna be covering this stuff with rugs very soon, but... Remember what I said earlier about, you know, that one thing that required nightlife and all that shit? And it also emits fire. And I keep fucking forgetting to use it. Well, here it is. The star of the fucking show. Direct from the bar. The fire jets. And I kicked this damn door down. In reference to the star of the show over there. The That Handsome Devil. Oh yeah, this is the work of That Handsome Devil. What is the cheapest, but biggest rug they can do? Cutesy and innocent looking enough. But, oh yeah, this could probably do the job, right? That way we're not using the most expensive rugs in the game, and in case we do fuck up, we can also just keep using these rugs, just keep burning this shit. Sorry to these. And we'll, we'll get this on board. But just, oh yeah. First things first before we even begin. I know we're probably a little over time. That's okay. And I don't have a goddamn desk to do this with. But we need to get uh we need to get Steven and the robot also out of here. Come on, Steven, you're going with me, kiddo. Away from this household. Alright, back to Nutcase. And before we begin with this whole ordeal, we are going to be getting rid of this now. And we're going to be attracting everyone over here. Get those beds out of here. Get that TV or that couch out of here. In favor of this couch. In favor of this deal. Yeah, everyone get inside this house. This deal. Oh yeah. Unlock, unlock. Everyone. I must have your undivided attention over here. No. Where the hell is everyone else? Oh, Viola's at home at work. Shit. So where is Anne? Anne is somewhere. Oh, now she. She refers to Viola. I'm gonna keep him in. Lock. Call over. Come on. 
Where are you now? Lobby only. One, two, three, four, five. Where the hell is, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Where's Anne? Anne's up above. Son of a bitch. Oh. oh, she's going to bed, so that's good. Okay, so she's distracted. Come on downstairs. No, 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 no. Come on, come on, come on. Fuck the phone. You can worry about it in just a moment. Come on, inside. No, inside! Inside, you fucker! Oh my lord, you fucking stupid. Oh my lord, come on. Oh, cause the phone. Cause the fucking phone. Come on. Inside. There. Now, nobody can get out of here. Except for me. <laughs> All right, well, just before we begin, we are going to save the slot. And I know we're above the hour mark, that's okay. Because this will be the finale. Indeed the finale, oh boy. The grandest finale you can think about for this deal. Oh yeah. That one's on fire! Our one's on fire! I'm on fire! It's like the Van Halen song. Now this is how you end off this series. But is there one die or is there one survive here? Oh shit. That case died. Oh. There he goes. Just keep burning, damn it. Keep on burning. Oh yeah, now we're good. Now we're burning up. Come on, keep it up. Just fucking burn up already. Oh yeah, we keep an eye on the pumped up pumpkin. I'm more interested in him though. Is he gonna survive? Yeah, you keep this up now. Oh, Viola's just like... What up? Oh, fuck off! Oh, it's because Nutcase is dead. Fuck. Nope, you're coming back. You're coming back over here. Like it or don't. Oh. Yeah, that's what you fucking get. That's what you fucking get. <laughs> Gee, come on. Get near the fucking deal already. Stupid. Well, this is not so much of a grand finale, is it? Frogs all this other bullshit in the way. Oh. There we go. Come on, keep at it. That's what you get for escaping. Oh, wow. Are I gonna burn up in there? Maybe you should get out. Probably not going to be able to get out. Aha. Pause, 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 pause. Now just lock it to pumped up pumpkin. And there she goes. Rest in peace. Well, pumped up pumpkin survive. No, no, fuck off. Don't go in the fucking door, you idiot. Supposed to fucking survive that shit. 
Get out. No, get out! Why are you going near the fire, you fucking dumb shit? Give me this brain dead, will ya? Oh my lord. Just fucking get out of dodge! Oh my lord, you are just... You may as well be suicidal. Oh, yep, yeah, he's gone. And he's done. Never mind, so much for survival. Fuck you anyways, pumped up pumpkin, you fucking piece of shit. You were gonna survive that and then fuck no. Oh yeah, let's go. Let's keep going. And then only one remains, and it's Satch Boogie himself. Man, I thought it was gonna be fucking pumped up pumpkin to survive that shit. Fucking garbage, man. I was gonna have him die and then have Pumped Up Pumpkin live. Oh, uh, well. I guess change of story, I suppose? Fucking Mr. Boogie here survives the fucking... Yeah. That ordeal. And even the fucking Pumped Up Pumpkin himself dies. Although, he has the power to resurrect himself, so it's not really much of a fucking deal. He's fine. He's perfect. He'll be back in, like, who knows. Yeah, monkey go! Monkey fucking go! Monkey survive a fucking fire. Fire hot! Ooh, ooh. Sure, yeah, I saved on that stuff, yeah, but I'm not gonna fucking redo all that. This is dumb. Well, yeah, so much for that shit. That's okay, that's totally fine. We'll just, uh... Any other urns I'm missing? You got nutcase, yeah, yeah. Oh, right. Upstairs. Doy. Hey, skunk, get the fuck out of the goddamn way, dickface. Fuck. I have no chill right now at this moment. I'm just gonna be like, fuck it. You get a free motive boost because why not? You survive that, you win. There you go. You're a winner. You're a winner. But we're gonna have to resurrect, uh... You. Aw, oh, man. Well, what the fuck? Where is he now? Hmm. Well, I wasn't supposed to go as expected. That's ah, okay, I can just... You know, I can always just do some behind-the-scenes kind of bullshit. At least I saved beforehand before I did all that shit. Which is a very good thing to do. Anyway, pardon for that minor cut. Anyway, pardon for the minor cut, someone just passing them by. Uh, pardon for, pardon for the minor cut that didn't really matter too much as someone was just passing on by. Not blasting music, but just, just anyway. We ended off, we're pretty much over time, it's all good. Uh, I'll fix it up much later, Such Boogie survived. The pumped up pumpkins trying to like, resurrect themselves there. And, yeah. The robot got away with the child and all that stuff. Well, that's the end of the seven-day round robin, and I hope you all enjoyed it. And I'll catch you all later for another playthrough or video in mind. Also, minor time travel real quick before I go. While I was reloading this kind of lot and stuff like that, I noticed a change here with Satch Boogie. Now he is pissed at his wife for cheating. But, hey, another time we got the angry pose. Holy shit. And I wasn't expecting that. So yeah, I'm just gonna do all this bullshit again, not on camera, but off camera, fix it up, do it for the next playthrough and shit like that in mind, clean it up for that kind of deal, and there we go. It's like fucking Pumped Up Pumpkin Never Died, or just came back from the dead properly and all that shit. And Satch Boogie survived, so that's all good. I'll let him survive, it's all good anyway, so yeah, for reals now, I have I'll catch you all later for the next kind of playthrough video and all stuff, so yeah, enjoy!